welcome to Panthaki Learn. Thank you for watching our video. If you like this video, kindly click on the like button and share the video to your friends. Don't forget to subscribe our channel. Here we are going to see uh, completely regarding towards DWT and SWT. In this session, we will be seeing like what is DWT and how to access that particular uh, transformations with that image inside this MATLAB and similar towards a small intro towards the SWT. In DWT, we will be also seeing how to reconstruct a particular image which is applied with Wavelet Transform over here. So, the Wavelet Transform application like uh, discrete Wavelet Transform as well as inverse discrete Wavelet Transform. What is DWT? So once when we come regarding towards the signals, all the signals will be having their own perspective noises. So that a particular noise, uh, like for example, whenever I am just recording this particular session, and here onto that uh, mic, it will be able to get different different noises. So onto that noises, how it is able to collect means it has some pores in order to collect the signals. The mic or the particular device is not an artificial oriented system like uh, this is a voice this is a noise like that it won't be able to segregate at all so we have to filter that kind of data and we have to overcome that particular function over there into this mic if i just turn on the fan and keep it near to that means therefore continuously it will be uh, following that particular wind only and that will create a disturbance on here so on to the disturbance whatever i speak therefore that disturbance will be mixed up over there then here the noise as well as that particular sound will be added over there on this particular mixture it is very difficult to separate them with the help of audio filters so similarly whatever the example i have said with the help of audio the same thing it has occurred with the help of the images like the purpose of D, uh, DWT or discrete wavelet transform like to remove the noises because once when we take the photographs whenever we take the photographs including that all the noises the weightage of the photo will be increased to reduce that particular weightage without any lossless compression without any uh, losing any of the compression techniques for that only this discrete wavelet transform will be applied because images is also similar to audio will be having a continuous signal so through that particular continuous signal we have to remove only that particular noise in the sense means we can apply the different levels of dwt so multiple level it comes under like a series so uh, we can just go for the first order second order third order like that but for all that particular images or the DWT, everything will be taken in the form of two dimension like x axis and y axis. Uh, the images tend to be grayscale. So, on to that, if you are just going for the different orders of this DWT, means so this image has been compressed first order, second order, third order, fourth order, fifth order, sixth order, and seventh order. So, like that, different different compression stages are there. On to the compression stages, it keeps on iterating that particular value, and those iteration of the value only here it indicates directly towards the section. So, therefore, let us open our MATLAB and uh, here I am reading some color image. Let us see what will be the uh, obtained output for color image over here. So here we have to declare four different variables in order to collect the four different values of the wavelet transform. So I have declared it as a, b, c, d. The function for initiating that particular dwt it is dwt2 which is second order. Now here we have to apply the parameters. The first parameter comes under the image whichever we have taken second parameter comes under simlet and the third parameter comes under the mode uh, which is used for the periodic extension 
so this uh, simlet as well as the mode should be entered within the codes to call that particular functions and finally the extended periodic value will be applied so this will be the particular display of different montage now on to this i am just displaying all the montage uh, in the form of montage so like uh, i comma a comma b comma c comma d we are going to display it in the form of thumbnail size empty parameter value now let us run the image so this termed as the five different types of image where this is the original first order second order third order and fourth not uh, order it is a different different parts so different different parts means the first one indicates the total image then comes with lower to higher portion of the image then vertical to lower portion and diagonal version so the whole image lower to higher vertical and diagonal so in that particular position only here we are able to collect the output so in this way only the transformation will be done from this transformation uh, we can apply more feature extractions and we can extract this particular portion so here we can see how much it has been applied as map this will be known as the basic level of discrete wavelet transform in image processing thank you for watching our video if you like this video kindly click on the like button and share the video to your friends don't forget to subscribe our channel